Hello, my name's David McClelland and I'm a tech journalist and a presenter. And I'm here today to help you out with some of your tech queries. So what we're going to talk about here is how to free up disk space on your computer. Now, your hard disk drive on your computer is where all of your documents, and your music files and videos get stored. And after a while, the disk drive can become quite cluttered and also start to slow down. You may even start to get warnings from Windows telling you that your hard drive is running out of space. So what we're gonna show you how to do here is a couple of ways of just doing a spring clean on your hard drive to get it running a little bit faster and so you can store more stuff on there. The first thing we're going to have a look at is how to empty your recycle bin. So if you click on start, then go to computer. On the left hand side here, you will see this little recycle bin icon with recycle bin written by the side of it. Clicking on this will show you the contents of your recycle bin. And what that is, is that anything that you delete from your desktop gets put into the recycle bin until you're absolutely sure that you need to delete it. So after having had a look to make sure you don't want to keep any of these, what you can do is do a right click on that recycle bin and then click on empty recycle bin. Alternatively, at the top here you'll also see an empty recycle bin icon. Clicking that will ask you just to make sure that you want permanently to delete them and away you go. They're now empty. Now one further place that you can look to uh, clear a bit of space on your hard disk drive is in all programs, accessories, system tools, and you'll see something here called disk cleaner. Now the good news is this does exactly what it says on the tin. So if I want to clean up my files only here from my C drive, that's the hard disk drive in my computer, what it'll do is first of all calculate exactly what files it thinks it's able to delete. These may be some temporary internet files or some log files and so on. Now the good thing about disk cleanup is that it gives you options as to what it is that you can delete. So it'll show you that your temporary files takes up 43 megabytes here, you've got some temporary internet files and so on. And it totals it all up at the bottom for you. Select the files that you want to delete and then click on OK. It'll ask you just to make sure whether you want to do that and then away you go. And so now it's going through deleting those files for you. Again, be aware this can take a little while depending upon how much cleanup it's doing. Now something to keep in mind here is that once you empty something from your recycle bin, it is gone to all intents and purposes. So really make sure there's nothing in there that you might have accidentally deleted. There are some utilities you can find on the internet that may help you get those back if you do delete them, but there's really no guarantee of that. So that's it. That's how to free up disk space on your hard disk drive.